Hey there! In today's video, we're going to cover the 2022 Mustang, the special editions, the new colors, and where those 10 horses might have gone. Stay tuned! Now, the 2022 ordering guide is out. I'm going to provide a link down in the description. The first thing I want to address is in the Coyote V8s. 10 horses have wandered off and, and took some 10 of torque with them. I'm going to have to assume that since there have been no hardware changes, that this was done through the ECM, through the engine management control. And this is something a tuner might be able to address and might be able to get those 10 horses back quickly. Just my opinion. Maybe talk to your tuner about that. Ford says there's eight new paint colors for the 2022. The ones that really kind of grab my attention are the Cyber Orange, Grabber Blue, Eruption Green, and Oil Slick Blue Purple. I'm anxious to see these on the cars once they start hitting the showrooms. Those that are interested in the Mach 1 Handling Pack cars and the Shelby GT500s, they want to get their orders in as soon as possible. The Michelin Cup 2 tires are always an issue for Flat Rock. It's, in, it's up near Detroit. It's cold up there. The Cup 2 tires become hard, and it's difficult to get the cars up on the on the carriers. So they delay production of those until typically mid to, mid to late March. So if you want one of those cars, you might want to get your order in early. Now, I did say order there, and that's a tip to any new car buyer. A dealer's more likely to discount a car that you order because they don't have to hold it in their inventory. And their inventory, for most dealerships, their inventories, they're actually financed through a, through a bank. So if that car does not have to sit on the lot for very long, they're willing to discount that car down a little Little bit. There are several special editions that we're going to get into. This is an end of run for the S550. Everybody knows the S650 is coming out next year. Typically when Ford does that, they release some special editions to try to entice some buyers. The Mustang Shelby GT500 Heritage Edition. This is a paint-only package. It's exclusive to this edition. It's a Brittany Blue with two different exterior stripe options. There's a painted over top racing stripe with a GT500 logo, available in Wimbledon white or absolute black, or a vinyl over the top racing stripe with unique vinyl side stripe featuring the GT500 logo. That's available in Wimbledon white. We see the return of the Mustang GTCS or California Special. The exterior features a blacked out grille, lower body side accent stripe, rear fender scoops, faux fender scoops, the Mustang GT California Special side stripes. It traces from the front of the fender to the signature rear fender scoop. A special badge, ebony and black race red script that decorates the trunk lid. A honeycomb grill with the GTCS badge in it. In addition, a larger front splitter from the GT Performance Package is added, as well as a performance rear wing for the fastback. The spoiler is deleted on the convertible. The California Special wears unique five-spoke 19-inch painted machine wheels. The interior of the vehicle features suede door trim inserts and suede trim seats embossed with the GTCS logo and red stitching on the seats. The instrument panel was finished in carbon hex aluminum with a California Special script badge on the passenger side. The Mustang Ice White Edition. This marks the first time in 28 years that Ford's offering a white-on-white -white Mustang. It's the first time ever for the coupe. It's available on the Mustang EcoBoost, Premium, and GT Premium Fastback models. The Mustang Ice White Edition comes exclusively in Oxford White and features iced-out tail lamps. I think that's the European tail lamps. Plus, Heritage-inspired 19-by-9-inch wheels in matching Oxford White with machine surface pockets. The Ice White Mustang Coupe comes with Oxford White pony badges and fender badging. The black and white interior features Oxford White leather seat inserts front and rear, plus Oxford white leather door panels, an aluminum applique on the dash, and white accent stitching on the center console, door panel, shifter boot, and headrest. The Mustang Coastal Limited Edition. This is only available on the EcoBoost Premium Fastback and Convertible. This package adds 19-inch machine-faced aluminum with tarnished black dark painted wheels, a unique vinyl side stripe that traces down the vehicle and comes over the hood, a signature Mustang rear fender scoop, a black grille, pedestal rear spoiler, and that's on the Fastback only. The Convertible, once again, won't get the spoiler. Coastal lighted sill plating, Coastal instrument panel badge. The Coastal Edition is available in Brittany Blue, Cyber orange and rapid red stealth edition this is mustang ecoboost premium models only the stealth edition appearance package features 19 inch ebony black painted aluminum wheels black pony badges a performance rear wing black mirror caps and new clear led tail lamp covers new interior appointments include a matte and gloss black instrument panel badge and a lighted sill plate the stealth edition is available in atlas blue carbonized gray dark matter 
mischievous purple and shadow black so that's it for the 2022 lineup we do know the s650 that's going to be a 2024 model but it's going to be released sometime in 23 we don't know what's going on with that car so there's been some spy photos that have been out there or camouflage cars there's been some renderings past renderings are almost always off base they say it's going to be a carryover of the engines the eco boost and the and the coyote don't know if that's going to happen. I've heard rumors of all-wheel drives, hybrids. I would tell you, if you want a traditional muscle car, you want a V8, you want a manual transmission, you want a rear axle, you may want to buy one in the next year and a half. Not Maybe not put it off. 600 subscribers. How'd that happen? It's just awesome. It really makes you feel appreciated for what you're doing. So if you could like and subscribe, that'd just be fantastic. Thanks so much. We'll see you.